And the first semi-final features Carl Lewis and Frankie Fredericks, this new find from Namibia. Actually, I must say the second semi-final is far better in many ways. We've got Leroy Burrell, Ray Stewart, uh, Jamaica coming back to the sort of form that made him co-holder of the Commonwealth uh, record. The Jamaican Dennis Mitchell, uh, Linford Christie and Sanguma all drawn in the second semi-final. So that's going to be a real tough one. Carl Lewis, well, for him it's all about the start. The semi-final should be a formality. But uh, if he's going to beat Burrell, he's got to beat him or catch him in the first 30 to 40 metres. There's the lineup. Zarignon of the Ivory Coast, only 20, goes in lane number one. Robson da Silva, Brazil, in lane number two. Oladarpi Adeniki, Nigeria, in lane three. Bruni Surin of Canada, in lane four. Carl Lewis, the champion in 1983, lost the title to Ben Johnson in 1987 goes in lane five. Frankie Fredericks in lane six of Namibia. Lane seven, Michael Green of Jamaica. And lane eight, Gariba of Ghana. The first four go through into the final later this afternoon. Lane six there on the green top. Frankie Fredericks, next to him, Carl Lewis, in lane five. This the first Namibia athlete, uh, Fredericks, to reach this level of international competition. Tremendous athlete, perhaps better over 200 metres, where he might even trouble Michael Johnson. 23, at the Mormon University of Brigham Young in America. Looking at the lineup there, Take along the colours with me. Zerignon of the Ivory Coast in lane one. The yellow of uh, Brazil, De Silva in lane two. St. Louis in lane five. We skip Bruni Sorin and also Adonikin. Small wonder that uh, everybody's concentrating on Lewis after that uh, wind assisted 9.80 yesterday. The first semi-final of the 100 metres. Clear break. And I suspect it's... Uh, well, the start has not actually named anyone yet. It might be a faulty start. And the marker goes up on Fredericks. He's not acknowledged it. Well, borderline, I think. But of course, the uh, blocks are electronically set up. There's a cable running to the starter who's got a row of buttons in front of him. If anybody uh, gets a false start, it's supposed to show in front of him. But uh, I think Fredericks might be called unlucky. first semi-final of the World Championship 100 metres. The first four into the final later this afternoon. Yeah. This time they go and in lane four Surin got a very good start indeed and Carl Lewis has got a lot to do and Lewis storming through with Fredericks and it's Lewis coming right through Fredericks in second place and third was Surin and in fourth place De Silva. Those the one, two, three, four. 9.94 and the wind 1.3 following. Perfect following wind really. And Lewis is flying and he got a terrible start. It was an awful start. He's been practicing out on the warm-up track. Uh, but watch him here in lane number five. And watch Surin alongside him. Lewis climbed out of the blocks. He stood right up and all that work outside has done nothing for him. Surin, a tremendous starter, born in Haiti, runs for Canada. But watch Lewis go now. There is no one from 50 metres out faster in the world, and that includes Christie. This is the fourth fastest run of all time. A legal run, too. And look at that stride. Fredericks in second place, Surin third, De Silva four. So it's America, Namibia, Canada, Brazil into the final. 
9.93 it's showing seems to have been uh, it looks like it rounded down in fact actually David I was talking to the timing people here just a little earlier on and they say that that now is the actual time that is the qu that is the time it's been rounded down to 9.93 the official time comes up shortly after the original uh, unofficial time Lewis did leave the blocks not too badly but he really didn't get up into his running as quickly as the others as you saw and the uh, fascinating news is it's a very good timing system this that they correct the uh, time immediately uh, as quickly as they can 9.93 and there's only one man in history run faster than that and you'll see him in a minute uh, Leroy Burrell uh, Lewis has equal that time of course he did that in the American Championship and of course he has been slightly faster at 9.92 uh, which was his old world record before Burrell took it well that